Matt, if you would please discuss see the Dawson case VA 2017-08 Todd Wilson. Yes, sir, Mr. Chairman. Um, the next two items involve the same property by the same applicant. Uh, Todd Wilson, this is a request to rezone and to annex property into the city of Valdosta. Uh, the subject, I think we can talk about these together, but when it comes time to make motion and vote, that we treat them as separate requests at that point. Um, the first one being the rezoning, and the second one being the annexation. Subject proper consists of 0 0.08 acres, it's about 3,400 square feet of land. It is located a couple hundred feet south of the what we call the southern terminus of Ravenwood Circle. This is on the western edge of Aldosta, on the western side of the Eager subdivision. Um, some of you may recall back in 2009, um, the parcel that you see on the map to the east, it's labeled R15, there were several acres of land that was annexed and rezoned, and the applicant at that time was Mark Eager. Um, Todd Wilson has purchased the property from Mr. Eager and is wanting to do a slightly different subdivision design with a different design cul-de-sac, um, and part of that new cul-de-sac design spills over into unincorporated Lowndes County, and hence the annexation and rezoning request. Um, here's the aerial of the, air, of the neighborhood. You see the house tops of the houses, the vacant field, which is the parent parcel next to the subject property, and then this is the proposed layout. Um, as we talked about at the work session, um, the city limits line is along the western side, and the subject property to be annexed is that area cross-hatched in sort of a gray diagonal tone. Um, and you can see how that all makes the cul sac and if you follow the right side of that hatched area, that lines up with the current city limit line. So the annexation is just to bring in this shaded area, add a little more land to the cul-de-sac. You sort of see on the other curve there where the former cul-de-sac design was to be. Uh, Mr. Wilson is um, proposing to shorten the street a little bit from what Mr. Eager was proposing and to reduce the number of lots from a proposal of five to a proposal of four. Um, in your packet, there's numerous conditions that are listed there. These are the conditions that were placed on the property to the east by the city council when it was annexed in 2009. So staff is recommending approval of this with those same conditions so that the conditions in the shaded area match the same zoning conditions that are in the property to the east. Um, subject property, here's the vacant field, and then some of the houses on the Ravenwood to the south. I think these are the two houses which are closest to the subject property. I'd be glad to answer any questions you might have. Thank you, Matt. Commissioners, any questions for staff on this request? There being none, anyone here tonight wishing to speak in favor of this request can come forward at this time. Anyone wishing to speak in favor of the request? Good evening, sir. Just state your name and address for the record, please, sir. Uh, Wilson, 2801 Country Club Drive. Yes, sir. I'm speaking in favor of this. <laughs> uh, what we try to do here is uh, this this land purchased my wife and I are going to personally build our house there there's there were four of the lots designed in but they would have been houses that would have been pretty tight on the lots particularly in the cold side As you can see what we've really done is just what is occurring at the other end of Ravenwood Ravenwood which is what we call an offset of the cold side and by doing that we're going to be able to align the fronts of the house and get a much more pleasing street front, plus get, and particularly in, say, the southernmost lot and the lot just to the, to the east of it, which is going to be my lot, we can get uh, a larger footprint. So I'm happy to ask you to answer any questions. Any questions for the Thank you, John. Thank you. Anyone else here wishing to speak in favor of this request? Anyone else here wishing to speak in favor of? Anyone here not wishing to speak against this request? Anyone here wishing to speak against this request? There being none, commissioners, if you've had a chance to consider this, and you want this considered on two different... Yes, sir, Mr. Chairman, this is the first one is the rezoning request, which is okay. from county conservation zoning to city R15 zoning. Yes, sir. That would be the first motion, and the second one is for annexation. Okay, commissioners, at this time I will take a motion on the rezoning request of VA 2017-08. Mr. Chairman, I'll second that. Second. Thank you. 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 Thank
So we have a motion for Commissioner Wiles. Do I have a second? I'll second. Have a second from Commissioner Roundtree. Do I have any questions or good discussion amongst ourselves before we have offer a vote on this? There being none, all in favor signify by raising your right hand. Ms. Carmel, that is unanimous. At this time, commissioners, I will also ask for the same request on, on their annexation, VA 2017-09. Mr. Wild. I'd like to make a motion that we also recommend approval of this request. Okay, so we have a motion for approval. Do I have a second? Second. Wait, wait. With, with the condition. With the one condition stated. And who's and Commissioner Ball seconded it? Any further discussion on this after, on this one? There being none, please signify by raising your right hand for approval. Ms. Carmela is also unanimous. Thank you very much. 